Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuir. In this class, we will discuss about the difference between LR of 0 and SLR of 1 parsing table. So, in our previous classes, we already discussed how to construct the parsing table for LR of 0 and SLR of 1. Please watch those classes and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, before going into the concept of difference between LR of 0 and SLR of 1, let's refresh one important point so that you will have a better understanding of the concept of a difference between LR of 0 and LR of, SLR of 1. You know, so this is what you have to understand. See, this is what happening. Suppose is somewhere in the derivation tray, we are here. E, e plus t, if e plus t is completed, this is reduced to e. Means e has been completed, e has been completed. The symbol that is going to identify after completion of e, what's the symbol we have observed here? Closed bracket. That symbol we call it as follow of e. So we discussed this concept after completion of E, the symbols that are going to obtain after completion of E, we call them as follow symbols. So this concept already explained in our previous classes when we discussed about follow. Now coming to our concept LR of 0 and SLR of 1. So in our previous classes when we discussed about LR of 0 and constructing table, let's take an example here. You take the example of I2 state. I2 state is having E tends to T dot means the production E tends to T dot has been completed. If the production has been completed in our table, we want to do reduce action. So here, this is what we have done. This is LR of 1 table construction. This is, SL, uh, this is LR of 0 table. This is SLR of 1 table. So in state 2, we need to do reduce action. That's why we have written R2, R2, R2 on all the terminal symbols. In LR of 0, what we have done? We have written reduce action in all the terminal symbols. But the difference in SLR of 1 is we are showing reduce action only on the follow symbols of E. See here e tends to t dot what's the follow symbols of e there only place reduce action so what's happening here what's the difference between these two here we are saying that reduce to e whatever the next symbol is we don't care about that that's why it's got the name lr of zero zero look heads we are not considered about the next input symbol but in slr of one we are considered about the next input symbols. We are placing reduce action only on the follow symbols of E. Follow symbols of E means after that we are going to identify the follow symbol of E because it is reduced to E. E has been completed. That's why it is going to do action only at the follow symbols place. Means it is going using a look ahead one symbol. That's why it's got the name SLR of one. That is the difference between a LR of zero and a SLR of one. Other than this, everything is same. Shift action and go to action is a go to is a similar to both LR of zero parsing table and SLR of one parsing table. Hope you understand the difference between LR of 0 and SLR of 1. If you have any questions regarding the concept, please post your questions in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you.